Anne Shirley, an imaginative and talkative red-headed orphan, arrived at Green Gables, a farmhouse in the village of Avonlea. She was mistakenly sent there to be adopted by the elderly siblings, Marilla and Matthew Cuthbert, who had intended to adopt a boy to help with the farm. Despite the mix-up, Anne's vivacious personality soon won over the soft-spoken Matthew, and eventually the stern Marilla. Anne's imagination often led her into trouble, like when she dyed her hair green in a misguided attempt to change its red color. Her fiery temper flared when classmates teased her about her looks, especially Gilbert Blythe, who called her carrots and tugged her braid. Despite this rocky start, Anne excelled in school, determined to prove herself. As time passed, Anne formed close friendships with Diana Barry, her bosom friend, and found a place in the hearts of the Avonlea community. She transformed Green Gables with her boundless energy and creativity. Her imaginative stories and dramatic flair brought both joy and exasperation to those around her. Anne's academic success led her to win a scholarship to attend Queen's Academy. Despite Gilbert's earlier teasing, they became friends and academic rivals. Both dreamed of becoming teachers and making a difference in their community. After a year at Queen's Anne returned to Avonlea with a teaching certificate. When Matthew passed away suddenly, Anne decided to stay at Green Gables to support Marilla, putting her own dreams on hold. Gilbert, showing his true character, gave up his teaching position in Avonlea so Anne could remain close to home. Anne's journey was filled with ups and downs, but her indomitable spirit and loving heart made Green Gables a place of laughter, learning, and love. She proved that with imagination and perseverance, even the most unexpected turns in life could lead to a beautiful and fulfilling path.